Hi guys, thanks for stopping in. I know I haven't been putting videos out regularly, just been a little bit busy with um, the whole nerve agent and stuff at my job and whatnot. It's a pain in the ass at the moment. Right, so this one here, I don't have many folders, but this is the Shrade one. Um, I only have fixed knives from Shrade, but it's not a bad knife. And the best thing about it is that I think it was like under seven pounds from Henny Hayes. Damn! which is amazing and um, tested this knife briefly I haven't sharpened it this is out of the box sharp the handle um, this kind of grip I have another shade similar to that one uh, the really big fixed blade knife I'm just I'm still getting used to it solid knife uh, has a liner lock on it so you can can close it with one hand like I said I'm not great with um, lock knives or folders I mean, the only one I really had and like is my Rat 2, so I'm still getting used to folders. Now, let me throw some specs at you while I throw some tests up on the screen. So it's a 9CR8 MOV stainless steel. The blade length is 8.7 centimeters. The blade thickness is 0.3 centimeters. Uh, closed length is 12 centimeters. The overall length is 20.7 centimeters. Uh, blade type is plain and it's a drop point. Uh, handles are aluminium or aluminum. Has a liner lock, no sheath, uh, does have a pocket clip and it weighs 142 grams. And um, I'll throw the measurements and uh, specs in the bottom in plain English if you don't like centimeters. But the only thing I would say is um, it does have a pocket clip there which is nice so you can just pull it out of your pocket quick and then oh there it is deploy it is smooth it, it does open smoothly it's just me being you know awkward with it I'm, just, I'm not good with the whole hand thing i cut myself half the time but yeah so the pocket clip i think on the ones i i've seen and had the main bit here is usually on this side and it draws out no biggie i mean it's just personal preference but yeah, so a solid knife, seven pounds. It's, it's a real steal, I think. So I'm trying to let everybody know, um, mainly because the people in my Facebook group, Prepper in the Woods, um, everybody's on a budget. No one has any money at the moment. Everybody's working two jobs, family, you know, whatnot. Um, I'm also making some budget uh, Tinder pouches, bushcraft pouches uh, for people in my group. I'm doing them cheap, uh, you know, and then I'm putting tinder and stuff in it for them and whatnot just to get people into bushcraft and outdoors and family time and do more stuff like that back to the knife yeah so ooh, see looks nice i like it uh handles all right you do feel that little bit of there when you grip it tight but overall everyday cutting boxes cardboard um zip ties all that kind of stuff this would be great so, and if you lose it, seven quid, breaks, whatever, not too worried about it, you know. So, it's a good find on that one. I do like it. Um, what else? But overall, I do like it. Very nice. Okay, let me know what you guys think in the comments section. Nice little drop point on it. Good thickness. Okay. I know no one like no, not people like Shrey too much because of what happened with Chris Tanner and preparing my 101 and stuff. But again, it's budget items we're looking for. Okay, not top of the name brand stuff. We have enough of that already. Thanks guys for watching. Sorry if I'm rambling. I'm just I'm tired. Uh, long day, family, all that kind of stuff. Thanks for sticking around and thanks for supporting my channel. Um, I'm gonna start being a bit more regular i'm getting used to the hours again so um i should hopefully put out some more videos the weekend I'm, my goals are to do some traps in the woods um i have that garberg to uh test um my puko i'm gonna make some traps with that stuff like that so there's some interesting stuff coming along so thanks guys for watching please like and subscribe and i'll catch your next video bye